Hi guys, I'm Angela Jean and welcome to my channel. Today is the second video of a series I'm doing called The More Powerful You for 2022. If you guys did not get to see the first video I did, it was the power of celibacy. If you are single, you gotta check that video out. It's very informative and it is from my own experience and all the joy and peacefulness and happiness it has brought to my life. So check that out. But today we are talking about cleaning up your life. And when I talk about this, ladies, I am talking about cleaning up your social circles. Yes, <laughs> because as you continue on this spiritual path, you are going to continue to expand. And with expansion, fortunately, inspires new people to come into your life. And if you're keeping the path going and if you wanna keep expanding, it also involves releasing people that are no longer serving you. Releasing people that encourage you to walk away from your spiritual path, from your spiritual health, okay? So that is something that you need to come to terms with if you wanna keep growing, keep expanding, and there is nothing wrong with this. But so often, we hold on to people that we've known forever, or we hold on to people because of guilt, or we hold on to people because family friends, neighborhood friends, or if you're in a relationship, you know, that person is the wife of that person. But at the same time, you guys, you can limit, 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 or completely avoid hanging out with these people. A few things to remember, you guys, is bad company corrupts good behavior. If you're trying to pave the way and you're becoming the better you, and then you go have lunch, with people that aren't changing all the talk and all the nonsense and that low vibration will suck you right back down. And then you gotta go back to square one every time you go back home because not only do you attract all that energy, they have junked up your mind and junked up your thoughts and you go home with all that kicking around in your head, you have to go back home and start all over again. You know what I mean? It's like mopping the floor and then a bunch of dirty dogs run in and get mud all over the floor. You know what I mean? I always like to have these analogies. And then you gotta clean the floor all over again and start over again. So it's just how many times you want to keep cleaning up the mental mess that the friends that don't serve you are creating because staying close to so many people opens all these uncertain doors uncertain doors of anxiety uncertain doors of stress i know i've sat with friends before and they've put a thought in my head that i would never think in a million years and then you start beating it around in your head and you can't have that you guys stay solid in your faith and aligned with god which is always love. Everything else is the ego enemy, scanning the environment, planting seeds through people to separate and divide you from love, you from God and you from source. So for the powerful you for 2022, I am suggesting that you walk away for your own spiritual health and expansion. And that is my rant for today. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this content, give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend. And like I said, if you're single, check out the video I did about celibacy on the end card. And I'll see you guys in a few days.